Fourth grade math number nine, benchmarks. What are benchmarks? Are they marks on a bench? Well, I bet that's probably how it originally got named, but a benchmark is a known number of things that helps us understand the size or amount of something. We use the benchmark to estimate the amount of something that is usually too large or would take too long to count one by one. In one of my previous videos, I showed you a jar of lemon drops. So here's our benchmark jar. It says that this amount is 20 grape jelly beans. So if you wanted to estimate how many grape jelly beans were in this jar, you could use the benchmark. If that's 20, and there's three of them here, that means we've got 20, 40, 60 grape jelly beans. Now is there exactly 60 grape jelly beans in this jar? Probably not. It could be 58 or 55 or 63 but it's probably close to 60 because our benchmark is telling us that that amount is 20. Let's take a look at shoes on a shelf. There are five pairs of shoes on this shelf, so our benchmark is each shelf can hold five pairs of shoes. If there's four shelves and each shelf is completely full, we can guess that there's 5, 10, 15, 20 pairs of shoes on this shelf. Now there could be a pair of baby shoes stuck in here as a sixth pair, so it may not be the exact amount again, it's an estimate, but it's probably really close to the real amount, okay? Let's take a look at this. What if one of your grandparents or your aunts or uncles made a beautiful flowered quilt and they embroidered all these flowers on there and it took them two years to make this beautiful quilt and you were curious how many flowers were on it? Well, if you knew that this amount was 100 embroidered flowers, you'd be able to use that as a benchmark to figure out how many are on the entire quilt. If that's 100, then that's 200, 300, 400, 500 flowers. Is there exactly 500 flowers embroidered onto the quilt? Probably not, but it's probably close. You'd have to count them one by one, and that would take a long time. So it's a lot easier to just use a benchmark and say there is approximately 500 flowers on the quilt. It's a good estimate. So remember, a benchmark is an estimate. It's not an exact amount, but it's probably close, and it's a lot easier to count large items with a benchmark than it is to do one by one. Keep up the good work, and I'll see you next video. Bye.